Yo, what's going on everybody? Expert Gamer here, and I'm coming at you guys with another Wi-Fi battle. This is about that I had against Julia. Make sure you go check out her channel and Twitter in the description below. But, um, as you can see, our teams are, like, super messed up. That's because it's a mixed battle. You bring whatever the hell you want besides Ubers. And I think battles are more fun that way because you get to see a lot of more Pokemon. You get to see... You get to, like, face OU Pokemon and we're using, like, an RU Pokemon. It's just fun, so... She's going to lead off with her Rotom uh, Wash, and I'm going to lead off with my Darmanitan. And now, that was a risky play. I should have just hard switched out, because I was banking that she was not Scarfed Rotom. If she was, and she went for a Hydro Pump, uh, I would have totally got destroyed. But after she used Volt Switch here, that pretty much told me that she wasn't Scarfed Rotom, because, well, I already knew, because my Darmanitan outspeeded, but whatever. So, she's going to Volt Turn out into her um, Hinata, and that's going to be her um, Gardevoir. Now she does Mega Evolve here, and this is one of the things that I hated so much about this. So, I go for the uh, Stealth Rocks knowing that I can eat up any special attack the thing wants to do, whether it's a crit or not, because I am a fully on, specially defensive uh, Deoxys defense, and that is like so bulky it's unimaginable. Imagine if you had an Assault Vest on it. I don't even want to think about that, that's so overpowered. But I just go for my rocks here because um, her Flareon does get hurt by them. And I'm pretty sure she had one other Pokemon that gets hurt by rocks, but I forgot which one it was. And she's going to Shadow Ball. Now, had she not have gotten the special defense drop, I would have been able to take another one. So that's what really sucked. So I had to pick a Pokemon to switch into here. Now, I thought that she would go for another Shadow Ball, but she predicted the hell out of me right here. I switched into my Sharpedo, thinking that she'd go for another Shadow Ball and I'd be able to eat it up. She goes for the Hyper Voice with that Pixelate boost, and my Sharpedo does just die. At least I think uh, Hyper Voice is Pixelate boosted because it's normal type. Um, so my Sharpedo does die. Had my Sharpedo not have died right there, um, the battle would have been quicker. But I just go into my uh, Darmantan Flare Blitz the hell out of it because I know that that thing can't take it. Because uh, that thing is really frail on the physically defensive side. So I take all that recoil damage. And now I'm Scarfed. And this is where I figure out that her Star Raptor is actually Scarfed. Because um, I was hoping that she was banded. I make, This is uh, another bad play I made. I was hoping that she was banded. I should just hard switch out into my Slow Bro. Because I know that she can't take a Flare Blitz with a um, Star Raptor. If she couldn't take one with a Gardevoir. But she is unfortunately Scarfed. So I switched into my Slow Bro because I can eat up any hit with this thing any physical hit so she just goes for another double edge and I'm going to just completely just absorb it but I just go for the scald here to kill off the star after and now I was gonna go for the ice beam but um uh, I just I just went for the scald just in case you wanted to switch out or something predicting an ice beam so um yeah I forgot what she switches into here I think she yeah she sends in her Latios now she was probably predicting me to switch out here uh, fearing a Draco Meteor, because I definitely die from a Draco Meteor, but I stay in and I go for the Ice Beam, and she goes for the Defog, and now, um, that didn't really do much, because, um, her Flareon still does go down pretty easily, so I just go for the Ice Beam, and it doesn't do that much damage, actually, it does, like, little to no damage, but, um, it's whatever, I was just hoping for, uh, I knew that I wasn't getting a kill, I was just hoping for a, um, freeze, so she goes for an Energy Ball, and I do unfortunately die, and then I switch in my... Who do I switch in here? I switch on my Darmanitan, I think. No, I switch on my Gengar here. And now, um... Right here, I was just hoping in all my power that she would not switch out until Lanoon. She doesn't switch out until Lanoon, and I am good to get off that Shadow Ball, and that Latios is dead. Um, had she switched into Lanoon, the, she might have won the battle, but, um, it's whatever. So, she goes on to a Rotom uh, Wash here, and I just go for a Sludge Bomb hoping that I can get the crit and the um and the poison but she has that dumb citrus berry my lord I hate that citrus berry so much but um she goes for the hydro pump here and my Gengar is going to be able to live it uh it doesn't it didn't really matter if I were to die from it because I am focus ass but it's going to live with the sliver had I gotten the poison the Rotom would have been dead but Gengar is going to go down here to a volt switch and she's going to switch out into her Lanoon I think this is what I know. She switches out into her Flareon, and this is where my um, Keldeo just comes in and cleans everything up because uh, I could go in uh, to Keldeo right now, just Hydro Pump, get Flareon gone, and then I just Secret Sword Rotom Wash, and I just Secret Sword Lanoon. 
So that's what happened, and that was a really good game. I underestimated her her uh, battling skills. That Sharpedo Hyper Voice thing. I was like, oh my lord, how could I let that happen? But uh, you know, stuff like that happens a lot. So Rotom Watch comes in. I just go for the secret sword. Ooh, that was a clean shot. That's already part of the thumbnail. My lord, that was clean when it was doing the secret sword animation. My lord. But um, Rotom Watch is gonna go down, and she's gonna send out her Lanoon. And I'm just gonna hit this thing up with a um, secret sword. She goes for an extreme speed, uh, you know, just to do damage. Had that have been a crit, I maybe would have died. I don't know, but I just go for the secret sword, and Lanoon is gone. So, like I said, make sure you check out her channel and Twitter in the description below. She has like Wi-Fi battles, all that stuff. But um, make sure you also check out some of the other Wi-Fi battles that we had on the channel. I'm starting to try to do a lot of more Wi-Fi battles rather than just battle spot because I know that battle spot can kind of get repetitive so I'm just trying to get a lot more battles hopefully we can get some tier battles going on like PU but uh yeah I'm expert gamer peace out